if you're looking for a Skeeter fishing ski boat, my parents are selling their 2008 Skeeter SL190. They purchased this October 16th of 2009. Uh, I'm going to say that motor has less than 10 hours on it. The boat uh, hasn't been used much and you can tell that by the immaculate condition. If you're looking for a great boat that's virtually brand new, it's just uh, been aged and it's been shedded its whole life. Uh, we'll take a little quick walk around here. Here's the trailer, the spare. Uh, not even chips off the trailer. You can even see the tire still got the little fuzzies on it there. Uh, this sucker is beautiful, immaculate shape. Just look at the glitter. It's an SL190. We have a Minn Kota. Um, this is the pontoon version. It's a got the co-pilot that's got the remote. Uh, you can use the foot pedal. The remote is back here. You can steer it from all over the boat. Um, does have a quick release. Pull this pin. You can take it off or you can actually move it back. Um, trim gauge here. There's your deal. Uh, two fishing chairs and a butt seat. You do have the padded deck. Carpet is uh, virtually brand new. Just look at it. I don't think you're going to find a nicer boat. It's got a Humminbird 798 there. We'll jump up inside here. Show you what it's about. It's got a four stroke Yamaha 150. You ain't uh, seeing no exhaust or nothing. It's perfect. See it here? Man, that paint is. That uh, fiberglass is slick. Um, very beautiful boat. Needs a good home. Needs somebody to be able to take it out, use it, and enjoy it. See the uh, sidewalls there. Trailer. Show you underneath of it. Yep, it's a. Uh, I'd call this thing brand new if it was my opinion, but uh, it has been used. Uh, doesn't have many hours. I would say 10 hours max is probably pushing it on that motor. Jump in here. There's live wells here. Storage here. Got a two bank Minn Kota battery charger. Uh, selling it as is can't guarantee on the batteries. They haven't used this for a while uh, Starting battery did die uh, first thing I'd say is you need to pump the fuel out and uh, Because it hasn't been run for several years Tow rope you can put your ski rope in here And another live well over here It's a great family boat. This will pop up here to you can take that out. So if you don't want to step on it, seat base pedal back there. Storage under cooler there. Another cooler there. Got storage here. These seats pivot. Radio is included there. Uh, st st little storage box here. That's the paperwork. It's even got a phone charger for the older phones there. Windshield. This is the Humminbird 798 side imaging unit. GPS mapping, 2D down imaging. Console. 
you have tilt steering, all your functions there, your key switch. That's the graph that came with it. Holder, gauge, safety switch. This is uh, ski storage. Got lights down there. Come up here. You can put rods or you can put uh, more tackle storage there. You have storages on both sides here. There's your seat bases. Seats are <laughs> virtually brand new. Got the pads that you can take off. They all snap on. They snap on here and back there. And get rid of them if you don't want to. If you don't want to put it in fishing mode. Another storage there. Have a butt seat. We bought extra for it. But that's it. It's a beautiful boat. Low, low, low use. So. If you're looking for a great great boat canopy does flip down and go over uh, we won't do that but uh, it's all here check it out give me give us a call this thing needs a good home somebody put it to use so if you're looking for a fishing ski the skeeter fishing ski is uh, very fish oriented uh, but it still allows you to get your family out there or give you a little different seating operation. It's a beautiful boat and it needs a good home. All the contact information there is in the, the video description, pricing and everything. Uh, give us a call and take it home. It needs a good home. Thank you for watching. Check out more videos from uh, DV fishing and uh, we'll teach you a lot more about boats and give you some opportunities on some great deals like this one. There's the GPS for the fish finder.